All right, guys. It's my 2004 Chevy Tahoe, and I'm having a problem where I have no brake light, no running light, um, no turn signal, and no lights on my license plate lights. Excuse the Tahoe. We've been helping people move, and we have one of those damn things busting and spill beads everywhere. <sighs> Anyways. So, right now I'll demonstrate it for you here. Let's see here. We should have taillight now, which I do. We have no turn signal. Let's go ahead and turn the turn signal on here. You'll see in the mirror it flashes quickly. Never actually had that problem before. Um, I'll I ran my battery down. Sweet. Anyways. So you saw the turn signal was turning flashing really quick. So let's turn the headlights back on and run the battery down just a little bit more. Well, see right now I have no tail light over here and I have a tail light over here. I'll probably shake this tail light a little bit. Oh, see the wiring harness down there? I'm gonna grab the camera here. Not the camera, the light. See how that wiring harness goes down through there? Well, if I pull on my wiring harness just a little bit, there's a junction box that is down here, and we're getting ready to dig into it. Alright, let's take a little trip under the Tahoe. So here's your fuel door right in there. And this is where the wiring comes down. And you're gonna have a problem in this connector right here. Take it apart, clean it, make sure none of your wires are coming out. I've got wires coming out of it. So that is my problem for everything. And uh I hope it fixes your guys' problems, too. Alright, so since it's middle, middle of winter, I went ahead and took my lights out and pushed my harness as far down as I could here in the taillight housing. And then I cleaned up all my harness. Now everything looks good here, and all my wires seem to be intact here. Um, the last time I had this apart though, I had one of these wires rip out, which was the ground causing all my issue. So, you guys are probably going to have your problem right here, or it's going to be on the other side of the big tail, which is up under the truck. But one of these wires is going to be ripping out, put it back in, solder it back onto the piece, and you will have yours fixed. I'm getting ready to go under the truck, do that to mine because none of these seem to be in any kind of trouble. Wish I could get the light on there better, but I can't. But all of these are still up here to the top. All the wires are connected still. So let's go underneath it and see if we got the problem there. All right, and it's fixed. We got under there, directly under there. We unplugged it. All I had to do was clean mine up. Mine got dirty and corrosion, so you can see there I got some dirty water, and right after that, I sprayed some card cleaner on it to dry it off, then used a contact cleaner for electrical. So we have a tail light now, we have turn signal now, and we've even got brake lights. One thing I currently still don't have though are license plate lights, so we'll dig into that. It's probably another connector just right underneath here somewhere. Just follow the connector license plate lights wherever they go and it's going to be the same issue. Hope this helps somebody out. You guys have a good day.